Welcome to the operational training video for the Technotest Baby Cool service machine. Here, you'll see an overview of the basic operation for the recovery, evacuation, and recharge procedures on air conditioning systems that use R134A as a refrigerant. Before we begin, there are several safety requirements that you must follow for the safe operation of the AC machine. This training video is intended only as an overview. For your safety and the safety of others, please read the user manual that came with your unit. Here is a description and setup procedure for the unit's external parts and user interface. The keypad is where you enter data and navigate through the menus. On the keypad are buttons and LED lights that activate during a particular function. The recovery function select button and LED. The vacuum function select button and LED. The charge function select button and LED. Two buttons move the display cursor up or down and increase or decrease figures. The automatic function select button and LED. The enter button and the stop button. The bright 40 character display will show you both input and output data while operating the machine. You may also select the language of your choice. The Technotest Baby Cool AC Service Machine is easy to use and technologically advanced. And there is a database port. The database is an optional addition on the Technotest Baby Cool. Near the bottom of the main panel are safety graphics to help remind you to work safely. A thermal graphic printer is also an option on the Technotest Baby Cool. This will allow you to print detailed service reports for your records or for your customer. The three gauges on the unit are class one pulse free gauges with three scales to measure PSI, bar, and temperature. There is the blue low pressure gauge, the red high pressure gauge, and the inside tank pressure gauge. These gauges monitor the various pressures in the system while the machine is operating. On the unit, there are two manual valves, the red high pressure valve and the blue low pressure valve. On the front of the machine, you will find the following, two hoses, one red and one blue, each measuring two and a half meters in length, and two bottles, an oil injector bottle and an oil drain bottle. These bottles store the oil recovered from the AC system and the oil to inject back into the system. Connect the bottles by inserting their quick connect fittings and pressing up on the bottle. The oil bottle fittings are airtight to prevent moisture from contaminating the oil, the refrigerant, and the AC system. The main power switch and power cord are found on the back of the machine. Before using the Technotest Baby Cool, it is necessary to inject some R134A refrigerant into the inner tank of the machine. Remember, this system only uses R134A refrigerant. Never attempt to use any other type of coolant. To inject refrigerant, connect the blue service hose to an external tank containing the R134A refrigerant. Now the machine is ready for operation and we will show you a basic AC service. Connect the low and high pressure hoses to the car's AC system as follows. First, connect the blue low pressure hose to the system's low pressure port and open the valve on the hose. Second, connect the red high pressure hose to the high pressure port and open the valve on the hose. The connectors on the two hoses are different sizes, so you cannot make a mistake. Next, open the high and low pressure valves on the Technotest Baby Cool machine. Press the recovery button on the keypad. 
The display will now show you the available capacity in the unit's internal holding tank. Press enter and the self-clearing function begins. The self-clearing process sets up the internal components of the machine to prepare the unit for accurate refrigerant recovery.